Yo, what's up guys? So in today's video, I'm gonna figure out how to get the best no scope bloom in Fortnite. I'm talking at the craziest trick shots, hit bangers every game. So yeah, I got my notebook here, I got my pencil. You know, we go test out some theories, how to get the best bloom. I consider myself a scientist, probably the best trick shotting scientist on Fortnite, who knows? But uh, yeah, let's get right into the video. So we on this map I built to test some theories. We got the dummy setup over there. And my first theory is figuring out which bolt has the best no scope bloom so i got the blue the purple the gold and i also have the barret which will come later in the video but we're gonna see which of these three have the best no scope bloom so i'm gonna take 50 shots at 50 meters and then another 50 shots at 100 meters just so we have two tests to compare uh so yeah let's get right on into it and start no scoping i don't know how long this is gonna take but i hope it doesn't take forever so yeah this seems to be about 50 meters i got the person in the dead center of my screen I got a dot on my screen if you guys want to see right there so I know that it's a hundred percent accurate what I'm doing these tests are legit brought to you by a scientist himself so yeah let's get to no scoping oh my god this is gonna take forever all right one hit one hit down oh we hit again all right yes all right all right we got three. All right. Well, that was 50 at 50 meters. We only hit three times with the blue bolt. So that's not that's not that good. I'm going to be honest with you. So now we're going to back it up to 100 meters this time and shoot another 50 rounds just to see what's the likeliness chance of hitting at 100 meters. So uh, there's the target. Let's just get back to no scoping. Oh! Oh, another shot. Come on. Last four shots. Please connect. That was such horrible bloom. Three. No! I broke I broke the I broke the dummy stand. Oh my god. Alright, this time I made my man's out of metal. Hope you don't get mad at me. We had two more shots left on this. He's facing away from us. He looks pretty mad at us. But we have two more shots with the blue bolt. Let's see if one of these will hit nope all right so i'm gonna do the math real quick we hit three times at 50 meters and two times at 100 meters all right so i did the math i definitely did it all in my head didn't use a calculator at all definitely did it all myself but with a blue bolt at 50 meters you have a six percent chance of hitting also with the blue bolt at 100 meters you have a four percent chance of hitting so you know let's see if let's see if the better let's see if the better bolts will do any better but i got the got the purple now let's go back to 50 meters and see how we can do all right 50 meters let's see if the purple one has some better bloom okay okay wait hold up this is why i use the purple bolt all right two shots already okay okay yo what is happening bro okay another all right it didn't let me down yeah purple bolt's doing way better than the blue bolt was doing you know i don't know if that's just lucky but we're backing it up to 100 meters you're gonna do the same test another 50 shots dummy set down range so yeah let's get right back to it come on purple bolt i had faith and you haven't even hit a single bullet out of the last 25 shots all right all right okay another hit all right so with the purple bolt i did the math with the purple bolt we hit eight times at 50 meters so that's a 16 percent chance of hitting also two from 100 meters so that's only four percent it definitely outperformed the blue bolt so i guess we're going to the gold bolt now you know it's the highest rarity it should be the best 50 meters aiming right at the dead center and uh yeah let's get some no scoping okay all right, all right, all right. Now, nah, if the gold bolt's the best, I'll be, I'll be astonished. Okay, another shot. All right, last one. I'm gonna do a 360. I'm gonna do a 720. All right, well, all right. So the gold bolt didn't do as good as the purple one, which is why I use the purple. I mean, <laughs> but uh, yeah, we hit four at 50 meters. So now we're backing it up to 100 meters, and uh, yeah, we'll shoot another 50 shots. Hopefully, it does better. Okay. Miss. Come on, don't let me down. Last bullet, last bullet. All right, 360. 
all right well let me down all right so with the gold bolt we hit four times at 50 meters and three times at 100 meters it's the most we've hit at 100 meters so yeah i'm gonna do the math real quick all right so with the gold bolt you have a eight percent chance of hitting at 50 meters and a six percent chance of hitting at 100 meters that's the best percent chance at 100 meters out of the blue purple and gold the purple bolt hit the most out of 50 rounds at 50 meters it hit eight times so that's 16 percent and the gold one hit the most out of 50 rounds at 100 meters which is three at six percent so definitely gonna have to stick with my baby the purple bolt i'm just saying all right for the next series moving forward i'm gonna be testing shots with my purple bolt since it had the highest percent chance at 50 meters and i'm gonna be doing all these tests at 50 meters now and the next two tests are gonna be whether pickaxe swing helps your bloom or whether shaking your head with the reload animation helps your bloom because people think that both of those have a chance of helping your bloom so yeah we're gonna test those now back at 50 meters all right let's start pickaxe swinging before every shot All right. Oh. All right. And missed. All right. So pickaxe swinging, we hit one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times. All right. Now we're going to do the head shake. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, if you already have a bullet loaded into your gun and you click R to reload, it does this little animation it shakes your head like you can't reload anymore people say it helps your bloom i don't get it but hey as a scientist i feel it is my duty to tell you guys if this works or not so yeah let's do another 50 rounds all right two all right last bullet 360 oh uh uh let's not talk about it let's not talk about it let's not talk about it all right 360 head shake miss all right so i don't know if i did that wrong i mean i was shaking my head as i shot but that was trash we hit twice shaking our head yeah i'm gonna do the math real quick tell you guys the percentages all right so if swinging your pickaxe at 50 meters you hit 14 percent of all your shots which is 7 out of 50 and with the head shake animation or clicking the reload button as you have a bullet already loaded into your sniper you only hit 2 out of 50 shots, which is a 4% chance at 50 meters, which is kind of close. So I'm definitely going to say that that does not work. Pickaxe swing might do a little something, but also it's the purple bolt. It did the best at 50 meters. So yeah. All right. For this next theory, it says using code Voxby help your bloom. So yeah, just put that in the item shop, you know, boom. And then we go back into creative and check. So yeah. Using code Voxby, let's see if it gives you better bloom. Like, using code Voxby literally gives you aimbot. Like, I'm not even stressing. I know I'm going to walk up here. I'm going to hit first try because it gives you aimbot. Watch, 50 meters, do a 360, look at him, boom. Like, I'm not, I'm not even worried. I knew that was going to happen. I'm not even surprised. Like, y'all don't believe me when I say these things. Like, all right. All right, so the next theory is, does a Barret have a better no-scope bloom than any of the other snipers? Because everyone loved using the Barret back when it was out. And so, yeah, I'm going to test if it gives you better bloom. So we're going to do the same thing. 50 shots at 50 meters. 50 shots at 100 meters. Just let you guys know if it gives better bloom than the bolts. But, uh, yeah, let's get to no-scoping. You know what? I can already tell it's going to be a pain. Nah, nah, nah. We are not testing that. What? Alright, so the next theory is that holding WASD makes your bloom worse and i'm pretty sure this is true it, i mean it makes the most sense you're moving around in the air as you jump i'm gonna jump off this press WASD as i no scope him and yeah just see how how much worse the bloom is okay wait we actually hit one oh wait we, we actually hit two what all right i'm gonna leap I'm gonna leap and hold W. Come on, please hit. Alright, well, uh, the theories are right. Holding WASD as you no scope definitely messes up your bloom. We only hit twice, which is like a 4% chance out of 50. So, yeah. And it was, I mean, it was at 50 meters. So, yeah, definitely don't hold WASD as you go for attempts. Alright, for the next theory, this is for my controller players out there. I got my controller. I'm about to hook this up. We're gonna see. 
if controller gives you better bloom. Oh, 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 what, what's happening? What's happening? Oh, all right. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Controller players, Justin, I'm coming for you, bro. Okay, hold up. All right, well, you know, controller definitely didn't change much. We only hit three times. I was like 6% out of 50. But yeah, you know, got some theories out of the way. So I guess in this video, we figured out that purple bolt has the best bloom at 50 meters. Gold bolt has the best bloom at 100 meters. Pickaxe swinging does help slightly. The head shake thing does nothing. Holding WASD is bad and controller is just the same as everything for no scopes. And that the blue bolt sucks. Alright, so that's going to conclude the video. If you guys have any more theories that you want the young trickshot scientist himself to test, leave them in the comment section below. I will be testing them in a future video. But yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really helps me out. We're like 4,000 off 20k. So once we hit 20k, I don't know what we're going to do. But it might be a little giveaway. So yeah, that might be in the future. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.